Hi guys, it's Gloria, a slow fashion blogger who is still stuck at home. I can't believe it's been two and a half months since the quarantine. I'm still sane, still keeping it together. And actually, the most fun I get to have is creating outfit videos for you guys. So yeah, I came up with more outfits for you. Not just any outfit though. In this video, I'm only going to be using this Everlane white linen blouse for all the outfits. This is a true test of whether an item is versatile or not. Now, can it pass the test? Let's keep on watching. This outfit is what I imagine I'd wear at the airport if one day I become a celebrity. To start, I'll wear my white linen blouse and my blue jeans. I'm pairing this with my nude sling bags. If you're a celebrity, usually you will style things up a bit, but make it look like you didn't even try. So I'm gonna add a belt and then half tuck my shirt to make it look effortless. I'll also wear a Panama hat because obviously I just came back from vacation. And of course, a pair of black shades in preparation for all the paparazzis. If we have blue jeans, why not white jeans? Of course, I'll start with my white blouse and a pair of white jeans that look exactly the same as the blue ones. No surprise there. Let me show off those ankles because I'm going to put on my, you guessed it, one and only pair of flat leather sandals. I'll also tie my shirt up because now I'm going to put on a brown belt to match those brown sandals. What a stylist. I'll tie my hair up, put on my straw boater, and carry a bucket bag like the fashion girls do. Remember this black silk slip dress that I ripped? Well, the tailor actually couldn't save it. He covered the hole with a little patch, but you can still tell it was ripped. Since my new one hasn't arrived yet, I'm going to wear this dress one last time before I turn it into something else. Or maybe I won't have to, because I can actually cover the hole by wearing my white blouse on top. Wow, that was a smooth transition. Um, I'll tie the blouse around my waist, and I'm pairing this with my new Reformation black heel sandals. I'll also braid my hair, put on a straw boulder, and carry my bucket bag. Now, nobody would know I ripped my dress, except you all do because I just told you. For this look, I'm styling my white blouse with a suede mini skirt that kind of has a 60s vibe. And I'll also put on my flat leather sandals. Since I'm kind of extra, I'll also wear a large silk scarf on my head as if I'm about to hop on a convertible. And of course, I'll put on these cat eye sunglasses to channel my inner 60s diva. I'll complete the look with my bucket bag. In reality, I don't actually go out with a headscarf on, but that doesn't stop me from dressing like this and dancing at home. For this look, I'll wear my white blouse with a pair of red wide leg pants, so red you can't ignore me. I'm pairing this with my black heel sandals. To take this outfit up a notch, I'm adding a black belt. I'll also tie my hair up and wear a Panama hat. Mmm, I feel pretty cool already. Well, to finish the look, I'll put on a pair of black shades because it gives me an air of mystery. I'll also carry a black bag and you don't know what's in there. Okay, maybe I just watched too many secret agent movies. For this look, I'm starting with my classic combination, a beige tank top and a pair of white shorts. I also put on my flat leather sandals. Now I'm just going to wear this white blouse open. Yes, the best thing about button down is you can wear it open or closed as you please. I'll tie my hair up and put on a Panama hat to make it look less like I'm wearing pajamas. 
Lastly, I'll put on my cat eye sunglasses and carry my bucket bag. And here you go! A very casual and relaxed summer outfit, especially compared to the previous secret agent outfits. Alright, for this look, I'm styling my white blouse with a pair of black and white leg pants, one of my favorite pieces. And I'm pairing this with my black heel sandals. To take this outfit up a notch, I'll put on a black belt and this black bucket hat that I finally get a chance to wear again. As a hataholic, making outfit videos simply gives me an excuse to wear hats at home. Anyway, I'll use this black bag to finish the look. Black and white will always be my favorite color combination, and I don't care what other people may say. For this look, I'm wearing my white linen blouse with a beige linen skirt. Linen on linen is perfect for summer, and plus if they wrinkle, they wrinkle together. I'm pairing this with my flat leather sandals. To style things up, I'm tying the blouse around my waist, I'll also braid my hair, and wear a colorful scarf around my neck. This is probably the most color I will ever wear. Lastly, I'll put on a Panama hat and carry my bucket bag. This outfit somehow reminds me of traveling in some exotic locations. God damn it. Did you know you can also wear your blouse underneath a dress? Damn right! For this look, I'm putting on a plaid dress on top of my white blouse, and I'm pairing this with my nude sling bags. To make it look less like I'm an underage teenage girl, I also put on my straw boulder, which makes it a little bit better, but now I kind of look like what I saw in those Japanese fashion magazines when I was 16 years old. I am way too old for this outfit, but it might suit some of you. For the last look, I'm styling my white blouse with a pair of polka dot pants. I haven't worn these pants for years and I recently rediscovered them. Now I'll tie my shirt up. I'm pairing this with my black heel sandals and a polka dot silk scarf to match those pants. I know, right? So smart. I'll finish the look with my bucket hat and cat eye sunglasses. You know what? I think I just look like a lady who has a weird obsession with Dalmatians. Alright guys, those are my 10 looks for you, all with this one white blouse. Think about it, if you can have 10 outfits with only one shirt, imagine how many outfits you can have with 10 versatile items just like this. Honestly, I would really be enjoying coming up with these outfits for you guys. If you would like to see more of the one shirt many ways series, let me know what you would like me to style next. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys again next week.